Welcome to Christian Natural Health with naturopathic Dr. Lauren DeVille. Christian Natural Health is the podcast on how to get and stay healthy, God's way. You'll hear topics on nutrition, exercise, sleep, avoiding toxicity, meditating on scripture, what supplements to take, stress management, defeating anxiety and worry, how to reconcile Eastern medicine approaches with Christianity, and a whole lot more. Now, here's your host, Dr. Lauren. Follow the Bible in a Year with Jack Graham podcast today. Begin your New Year's resolution with the Bible and see why millions have already started Bible in a Year with Jack Graham. This podcast was created to help you solidify your faith as you experience the story of the Bible through live action recordings and emotional orchestral music. Listen to Bible in a Year with Jack Graham on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts app, or wherever you get your podcasts. Welcome back to another episode of Christian Natural Health. Today I'm going to be talking about your glycocalyx. So it might be hard to believe that such an obscure word can represent something so important. Yet, in fact, improving the health of the glycocalyx has been associated with a significant decrease in all-cause mortality. So what is the glycocalyx and how is it possible that keeping it healthy can protect against many diverse potential causes of illness and death? The glycocalyx is like a furry coat worn by each of your cells made of sugars with proteins and fats attached to them. The word actually means sugar coat. The purpose of this sugar coat is many and varied and depends upon the type of cell in question. Trapped inside the fur are many other types of important cells too. These include cytokines or messengers from the immune system, albumin for stability, as well as the powerful antioxidant superoxide dismutase or SOD. All of this acts as a barrier to toxic insults and foreign invaders. The glycocalyx also lines the inside of the blood vessels and performs a number of functions to protect the vasculature from damage. The extra layer protects the sensitive endothelial lining from shearing force from the blood pressure itself, but it does much more than just this. The glycocalyx is protective against inflammation to a point. Too much inflammation can cause the glycocalyx to break down, which renders the cell more susceptible to inflammation in the future. It prevents clotting. It regulates vascular permeability, acting as a gatekeeper that decides what gets to come in and what has to stay on the outside. Since plaque formation typically occurs when foreign cells are absorbed into the intima, which is the inside coating of the endothelium, this is a very important function for protecting against heart disease. The glycocalyx inside the blood vessels also helps to mediate release of nitric oxide, which regulates blood pressure and vascular flexibility. So given the above effects, a healthy glycocalyx will result in better circulation, particularly to the extremities fed by tiny capillaries. Better circulation generally means more nutrient supply and faster metabolic waste elimination. To put it simply, healing is in the blood. By contrast, when the glycocalyx is unhealthy, capillaries are vulnerable to damage, which means the tissues they supply won't get the nourishing blood flow they need. This means those tissues and organs starve. Poor blood flow has been connected with a number of chronic diseases, some of which cause poor blood flow, such as diabetes and heart disease, and others which may result at least in part from poor blood flow, including inflammation and cancer. With respect to cancer, healthy healthy cellular glycocalyces actively help to to prevent cancer cell growth as well. Like everything else, cellular glycocalyces are subject to entropy and degrade over time, even if there aren't any other specific insults. But the usual suspects are also involved in accelerating the damage, including a high sugar or simple carbohydrate diet, smoking, hypertension, high cortisol from stress, and chronic inflammation generally. With respect to diet, one study showed that high blood sugar for only six hours reduces the volume of the glycocalyx by 50%. As mentioned, the glycocalyx also contains an antioxidant enzyme called superoxide dismutase, or SOD, which converts the free radicals to hydrogen peroxide. Without this free radical quenching enzyme, a cycle of oxidative stress and inflammation ensues in the vasculature. Because of this process, adding an antioxidant support can be helpful in treating high glucose as well in order to prevent vascular complications. The naturopathic philosophy always involves removing the obstacle to cure and when relevant giving the body the building blocks necessary to help it heal. So in addition to avoiding the stressors that tend to damage the glycocalyx, you can also directly help it heal by taking supplements of the proteins of which it's made, at least in theory. These include the common joint supplements, glucosamine, chondroitin, and hyaluronic acid. It would also include fixing the cause of low albumin, if present, since that too is a structural component of the glycocalyx. One study found that those taking glucosamine and chondroitin had a 39% reduction in all-cause mortality and a 65% reduction in cardiovascular mortality. 
So clearly they're doing more than just supporting joint health. Presumably this dramatic finding is due to the glycocalyx effect. One study on chondroitin echoed this finding as well. Hyaluronic acid has likewise been found to help restore the glycocalyx. Anything that supports nitric oxide can also be helpful and of course that includes most fruits and veggies. So I will link in the, the uh, show notes to the blog review this comes from and there's tons of studies that are linked in there if you wanted to find out more. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you next week. Are you looking for a holistically minded healthcare practitioner who truly treats root cause rather than symptom suppression? Unfortunately, even in the alternative healing professions, this isn't a given. That's why I've created wholehealthdoctor.com, a resource to help connect patients to healthcare practitioners in their area who share a root cause philosophy. Alternatively, most of the practitioners listed also practice telehealth. So if there isn't anyone local to you, you can still find a great practitioner to help you regain optimal health. Go to wholehealthdoctor.com. That's whole healthdr.com, type in your location or just the specialty that you're looking for and find the practitioner who's right for you. Follow the Bible in a Year with Jack Graham podcast today. Begin your New Year's resolution with the Bible and see why millions have already started Bible in a Year with Jack Graham. This podcast was created to help you solidify your faith as you experience the story of the Bible through live action recordings and emotional orchestral music. Listen to Bible in a Year with Jack Graham on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts app, or wherever you get your podcasts. Thanks for listening to Christian Natural Health. This show is run by you, so please write in with topic and guest suggestions for future shows. For more great content, subscribe to Dr. Lauren's blog at www.drlaurendeville.com or follow her on Facebook or Twitter at Dr. Lauren DeVille. If you enjoyed the show, don't forget to share it with your friends and give us a five-star rating in iTunes. It really helps us to stand out so other people can discover great content as well. Have a great week and God bless you. Is your 2023 starting without a bang? Has yawning become your dominant characteristic? You are not alone. This year, millions will be diagnosed with low energy or low E. But Planet Fitness has the cure. With clean, spacious clubs and tons of equipment, you can boost your energy after one workout. Leave low E behind and find your big fitness energy at Planet Fitness. Join in the free PF app for $1 down, $10 a month. Sign up today. Deal ends January 19th. See Home Club for details. This week on RVER, sponsored by Progressive Insurance. Oh, that new doctor is dropped at gorgeous. Oh, please, he's just another RV League educated surgeon with good hair. No, he's different. Nurses, we got a classy motorhome with a detached driver's side mirror. Meet me in the OR. Stat. Right away, doctor. No, 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 she's on break. I'll handle this one. Oh, you conniving little... When your RV really needs saving, Progressive has you covered. See if you could save with a leader in RV insurance. Progressive Casualty Insurance Company and affiliates covered subject to policy terms.